Sandy, welcome to Easy Cooking. So today I'm going to be showing you how to make a vegetarian dish. I'm going to be showing you how to make garbanzo patties. They are really easy to make, super delicious and very healthy. The preparation time is going to be about 5 minutes and the cooking time is going to be about 10 minutes. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Let's get started. You will find the list of ingredients in the description box of this video and you will also find it in my blog where you can print the whole recipe. Let's get started. In a food processor, we're going to combine the garbanzo beans with the carrots, the onion and the breadcrumbs. Also add in the fresh parsley and the egg white. Season this with the spices, I'm using garlic powder, salt, black pepper and crushed red pepper. Now we're going to combine this in the food processor for about a minute or two. You don't want any big chunks of vegetables in the mixture, but you don't want it to become a puree either. You're looking for this kind of texture, you can still see all the different colors from the different ingredients in there and there is still a little bit of texture from all the vegetables but there is not any big chunks in there so this is the kind of texture that you're looking for. So once you're happy with the texture, now taste the flavor and add salt and pepper if needed. If you think the mixture is too dry, feel free to add about a teaspoon of extra virgin olive oil. I think my mixture is perfect so it doesn't need any olive oil and it doesn't need any more salt and pepper so it's perfect the way it is. Now I'm going to make the patties. I'm going to divide the mixture in four equal sections to form the patties. If the patties are not holding together it means the mixture is too dry so feel free to add about a teaspoon or two of extra virgin olive oil and that should keep them tied together. So once the patties are done, now you can cook them. I'm going to cook them in a skillet on medium heat for about 5 minutes on each side. But if you prefer, you can bake them at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for about 15 to 20 minutes or until they are nice and golden brown. I drizzle the skillet with a little bit of extra virgin olive oil just to prevent the patties from sticking to the pan. And now I'm going to cook them for 5 minutes on the first side, then I'm going to flip them around and then I'm going to cook them for another 5 more minutes on the second side. And this is how they look once they are done and I have to admit I already ate one of them. They are so delicious, I really recommend this to you, they smell amazing. I'm going to serve them on a bed of baby spinach and I'm going to garnish them with pico de gallo. The pico de gallo has onions, tomatoes, jalapenos, cilantro, cucumber and avocado. And, and it's seasoned with lime juice and salt and pepper and that's about it. I'm going to serve this with two slices of bread and I'm going to garnish with more uh, fresh parsley. And that's about it. There you have an amazing and healthy lunch or dinner. If you prefer you can serve these patties in a hamburger bun and they are equally delicious. Enjoy! To print these and some other delicious recipes, please don't forget to visit my blog, the link is going to be down below. And remember you also find me on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram, on Pinterest, I'm everywhere, so all the links are going to be down below. If you want, you can check them out. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to this channel to be notified of future updates. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye!